He's Phoebe and he lives in Perth Making super videos for all his work His channel is great He's a good mate with Bella Fell so don't hesitate G'day beer lovers It's our old mate again here VB Ed ah. G'day beer lovers Dinner in the Sky is a unique offering for Perth. Yes, yeah, just arrived in Perth. It's only going to be here for a few months. And diners are basically lifted 60 metres up into the air by a crane and they enjoy these beautiful views. And the food on these flights, they're called flights, are prepared by the top chefs of the world. Yeah. So they've situated this Dinner in the Sky experience on the South Perth foreshore in Perth and it enjoys fantastic views of the city and the Swan River. You know they have canapes, they have champagne on arrival. The chairs pivot 180 degrees left and right every eight minutes and the views that the diners have from up there just constantly changes. Now a lot of the food is beef and seafood which is grown in Western Australia. There are 22 diners per sitting and you can have a lunch there, a brunch or a dinner. Uh, you know, the, the brunches cost $225 per person, the lunches $295 and dinners cost $395. So who out there wants to shout me a dinner? <laughs> I'll, I'll be your guest, I'll come with you. Now the longest that the people are left dangling in the air is 90 minutes. And anyone who needs to go to the toilet or get back on the ground quickly, they can get you safely back on the ground within a minute. The people who have created this idea and have brought this idea to Perth have conducted more than 100,000 flights around the world since the floating restaurant began in Belgium more than 10 years ago. So that's where it started in Belgium and there hasn't been a single accident in all these years. But I bet you the occupational health and safety people in Perth here must be having a fill day to make sure that it's safe. They reckon that they've operated in lightning storms and earthquakes in Japan. So, yep, yeah, perfectly safe they reckon. So there's an there's a underlying question. What happens when a diner wants to go to the toilet? Okay, well you might just have to book a flight to find out what actually happens. But my understanding is they can get you back down to terra firma very quickly.